Welcome to the Pro Kitchen custom color tutorial. Pro Kitchen software now gives designers the capability to capture custom colors from any file to use for room textures and custom cabinetry finishes. With the easy to use eyedropper tool, designers can capture specific colors from any file or web browser on their screen with just the click of a button. Give it a custom name, and then once saved, you can apply it to any room element texture or use it for custom cabinet colors. To get started, first make sure that the color you want to import is visible on your computer screen along with your Pro Kitchen. Or, if you use multiple computer screens, have it open on your second monitor. For this design, I'll be adding custom colors from the Benjamin Moore website. So I'll open my web browser and navigate to their website. Then I'll minimize it and arrange it on my screen so that I can see it in the background with my Pro Kitchen program. Now, open your image collections in Pro Kitchen. Navigate to the View and Settings tab and select the image collections icon from the right hand side of the ribbon. In your image collections, you'll see a new folder colors. This is the folder that will enable the eyedropper tool and let you capture a custom color. Select the colors folder and once selected it will be highlighted in blue and then you can click on the eyedropper icon in the top toolbar of the image collection dialog. A dialog box will appear indicating the eyedropper tool is active. Now with the eyedropper tool active Hover your cursor over the color you wish to capture, and then left click directly on the color. This will capture that color, and then Pro Kitchen will display it in the preview image in the collections dialog box. Now, before you can save the color to your colors folder, you have to name it. Typically, you'll want to name the color after its original name, but you can give it a custom name if you wish. And then once named, click OK to save. You can organize your custom colors folder by adding subfolders, renaming them, and then adding colors to those. To do so, select the colors folder again, it will be highlighted in blue, and then click on the add folder icon in the top toolbar of the image collection dialog. That will add a subfolder under your colors folder, and by default, Pro Kitchen will name it New Folder. Double click on the tax name to rename it, and then hit the Enter key on your keyboard to save. Now, select your subfolder, click on the eyedropper tool to activate it, hover your mouse over the color you want to capture, left click to capture it, and then name it and save it. To use your custom colors for room element textures, open your design settings from the ribbon under the View and Settings tab. In the Design Settings dialog box, open the Textures tab. Select the texture you wish to use your custom color for, and in the Select Texture dialog box, open your User Collections folder found at the very bottom. Select your Colors folder, and your colors will appear below for you to select and choose. Then click OK to save your design settings. Now, when you open your design in 3D, you'll see your custom color applied. To use your custom colors for cabinet finishes, First, make sure that the catalog you're working with allows custom paint finishes. Not all manufacturers offer it, so this feature is only available with the manufacturer catalogs that do, and also the Pro Kitchen catalog. Now, open your global specifications by selecting the global options icon from the ribbon under the View and Settings tab. In the Global Specification View panel, 
Set your global options normally, selecting each option according to your design preference. When you get to the Finish Settings, you'll see an option titled Custom Collection. Double-click that and in the dialog that appears, you'll see your custom colors that you've added to your image collections. Select the color you want to apply to your cabinets and then click OK to save. Or if you need to add an upcharge in price for this custom color, you can type that in the upcharge percentage field area in the upper right hand corner of the custom collection dialog box. Then click OK to save. Now, when you render your design in 3D, you'll see your custom color applied to your cabinets. And that's it! Now you're ready to start adding any custom color to your pro kitchen.